Karen O'Brien, and this is my YouTube channel, Boston and the Burbs. Every Wednesday, I publish a video on topics that will help sellers, buyers, even investors with real estate tips, as well as profiles of towns around Boston. So maybe you never considered some towns right outside of Boston, but it might be an affordable option. Today, I'm going to share with you data for the last three months. So that would be, it's mid-January 2021. November, December, January. And only for the most affordable neighborhoods, which would be Rosendale and Hyde Park. You never know where you'll find a job. Uh, first thing, single family homes uh, for Rosendale. Total properties closed in these three months were 28. Um, average days on market, 25. So what does that tell you? The market's hot. And let's see. I'll, I'll give you an idea. Someone bought a house for $330,000. So okay, so it needs work. There was one on the market and it sold for $485. It was actually on the market for $449. 108% over closing. So this will help you see the more affordable, the more you might have to go over. Um, 500,000 range, 552. Six of them went on the market around 550 and the average price was 552. Six to 700, seven on the market, seven to 800, seven on the market. This is Rosendale. In both categories, one sold for 650 or the average and the other average, the higher average is 731. Maybe a bigger house, um, but the, the prices are going up in the most affordable neighborhoods. There were two over a million in Rosendale, 1.127,500. When you're shopping, you need to build in in this market probably for the rest of the year because the market, the rates are still low. Because the rates are still low, you can afford a little more house. The minute those rates go up, you're going to see the prices freeze and come down a little. But it all comes out in the wash because your payment is very similar. I did a video on that and it's about mortgage. Why now is a good time to buy. Rosendale condominiums sold in that three month period were 57. And the least expensive one was $241,000. So there are still deals to be had. Between three fifty and four hundred thousand, average price they were three sold and average price three hundred and eighty two thousand. Between four and four fifty, eight of them went on the market. Average price four hundred and twenty thousand. It looks like four fifty to five seventeen. That must be the sweet spot. Seventeen went on the market. Four hundred and seventy thousand was the average price. 500 to 599, 13 went on the market, 528 of a nice condominium in Rosendale and six to 700,000, six went on the market, average price, 637. Now less as the price goes up, seven to 800, four, average price, 715. Eight to 900, five. Uh, 862000 So this actually could be um, a large space in a three-family or it could be a two-family made into two condominiums. Total apartments, I mentioned 57. So the average price overall for these 57 apartments, uh, a condominium is 537000 Highest price, 875 Lowest price, 241 So that's Rosendale condominiums. Now let's get into Hyde Park, single family homes. You know, there's three or four different sections of Hyde Park, so it's kind of worth, worth your while to drive around and check out the neighborhood. The most popular was the five to 600 price point, and there were eight single family homes that went on the market. Average price, $560,000. Six to seven hundred seven went on the market, and average price six fifty five. Um, one sold higher at seven sixty one, and two sold lower three eighty five four seven four thirty seven, um, and actually three 
average price four seventy five. So there are single family homes total sold in that three month period in Hyde Park were twenty one, and the highest was seven sixty one. The lowest was three eighty five. Average five seventy five. So between five and six, you can still get a single family home in the neighborhood of Boston, Hyde Park. Now condos, eighteen. I don't think there are as many condos. Oh, they're going to be building some near the Reedville section. Uh, I'm not sure if it's rentals or condominiums. 450 and 500, there were three. 461 was the price. And between 500 and 600, three, 576. The total were 18. The highest price was 718. There were three, just over 700. Average price of 700 and one at 615. Everything's more affordable in Hyde Park. Hyde Park, it's right next to the suburbs. So Milton's right next door. Uh, Dedham is right next door. It might be worth checking out. It's kind of easy to get to the highway, maybe more than Jamaica Plain if you're a commuter. That's the details for. Uh, Hyde Park and Rosendale. If you need more information or you want to ask questions, please just make a comment below or contact me. It's in the description below. You can text me or email me or whatever you like. Thanks for watching. Wednesday, every Wednesday, a new video. Please subscribe. Thank you very much.